Now let's try the traveling hip twist. Keeping the knees bent, chest lifted, lower abs engaged, tailbone down. We're going to twist front to back, keeping the movement horizontal to the floor. So we're just twisting the hips. Now we're going to take a step with the right foot, crossing left behind, and again, right, crossing behind, right, crossing behind. And make sure you're taking very small steps, keeping the movement right underneath your hip bones. We're going to switch the footwork. We're going to start with the left, crossing the right behind, and left, right behind. And again, keep it really small. The smaller the movements are, the easier the hip work will be. Now, we're going to combine the two movements together. We're going to bring the hip back. And we're going to release the right foot. So this is the right side. It's active right now. We're going to step onto the right leg and push the right hip forward into a twist. Then we're going to bring the left foot behind, bringing the hip back. And step forward, cross back. And forward, cross back. And forward, cross back. We can switch the movement as well. So starting with the left foot, we're going to bring the left hip back, lifting the left foot off the floor, step onto it, pushing the left hip forward, and bring it back. Step forward and back. And we're focusing on one hip at a time, but the other hip is obviously working. So let's try that a little bit faster and try it with music. And forward and back. And left, cross, left, cross, left. And this movement is a little bit easier if you're traveling faster if you come up on your toes. So starting with the right hip and forward. Keep the knees slightly bent no matter what. Chest is lifted. And faster. And that's how you travel with a hip twist.